Y'all, they done opened up the watermelon. This is the watermelon that was growing outside. It ain't mushy, huh? Nah. We saving the seeds, y'all. That's the other half. So what does it taste like? Jaden like that one. Is it mushy or something? Yeah, the mud the inside was all mushy. It was, it was all mushy? Yeah. So tell us what that one tastes like. The one that we grew. What it tastes like? It's not sweet at all? Not real. You don't like it, buddy? It's real randy. You just like, cut some rind off. Yeah, but like this rind is different. Like other rinds, I can eat the rind. This a rind that ain't ready. That's what it is. You eating the seeds. Can you not? <laughs> we need those seeds. We saving all these good seeds. Bailey, no, you can't have none, little piglin. No, 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 no. Y'all, look at this. This is the watermelon from the grocery store. When he uh, opened it, it, was, it wasn't good. But look at the seeds. Look at how small. I've never seen a watermelon with uh, seeds that small. Have you ever seen that? Mm -mm. She literally touched it with her mouth. Bailey, chill. And this is the one we grew, y'all. Look at this. Look at that. What is the problem? What's up, y'all? We are having chili cheese sausage dogs today, and I'm about to make the chili. So, I chopped up a whole bunch of chili cheese sausage dogs today, and I'm about to make the chili. So, I chopped up a whole yellow onion. Whole yellow onion, y'all. I'm using ground beef. <gasps> no! That was, um, it was, that one was almost three pounds of, uh, ground beef. Almost three pounds because some of it was taken out. You know what, I should bring my uh, other little uh, tripod over here so y'all can see the inside of the pot. Let me do that, hold on. Boom, baby. <laughs> Got me a good tripod. You know what, I could actually turn this light on. Wait a minute, let me see if I could. Hold up, y'all. There we go, we got light too. Girl, your girl is doing it. Y'all in there like swimwear. All right, let me, do I need to turn the light up, baby? Cause we can. Oh my God, this is amazing. 
Every content creator should have one of these, honey. So we're just going to brown this meat. I'm feeling real confident now. And after we brown it, y'all, we're going to drain this. Now, beef is the only meat that I drain. I don't drain turkey because it doesn't make all of this fat. But beef does, so. Make sure you break down all of those big chunks. Because you don't want that in your chili. Just want some nice smooth chili. And if you're interested in this tripod, it is on my TikTok shop, y'all. Just go to TikTok and you'll see my showcase. This is perfection. And it's not even expensive. It's cheap, y'all. Very much cheap. Or inexpensive. Not cheap because it definitely isn't cheap. Okay. Let me turn this down a little bit. Now I'm about to go and um, drain this meat. All right, y'all. Drained it. Now we're going to add the chili seasoning. We're going to add, I'm going to add three packs. You're supposed to add one for every pound of meat. But since this is almost three pounds, I'm going to add three. Boom. Then you're gonna add all your other seasonings, like garlic powder. Um, a little bit of Tony's for now. We're gonna see if we need any more later. When we taste it. Onion powder. Okay. And cumin. Marshall says add celery seeds, but I cannot find our celery seeds. I don't understand why. Let's mix that together. Nice and seasoned. Now, before I add the chili beans, I'm gonna take my part up out of here so y'all gonna see me do that because I can't have beans and uh, Jaden loves chili, so this is for him also. And I'm not adding any tomato sauce either because Jaden seems to like it without tomato sauce, so I could just, I'll just make it without it. We're gonna pour in our water. That was a half of a bottle. This is a full bottle. Stir up all of those drippings at the bottom of the pan. Get it all up. So that's two and a half bottles of water. Um, 
I don't know if I should add any more. Let me go ask Murder Show. <laughs> Probably need some more. Just know it'll always cook down. So I need to find my celery seeds. Add celery seed to this, or you can like chop up some celery. That's how my show does it, y'all. So I want to do it exactly how he be doing it. Okay. Let me go find my celery seed real quick. And I'll be back. Y'all don't tell nobody, but I'm about to add some of this beef bouillon. Just a little bit. Let's see how that amp it up. <laughs> Girl, the damn on celery seed was sitting right in my face. Ugh, how annoying. I guess that much, because I don't even know how much to add. So I'm going to turn the heat up a little bit more. All right, and we're just going to let this cook down until it's ready, Freddy. Oh, I forgot. Add some um, minced garlic. Where's my minced garlic? Where is it? Where is it? Here it goes. I'm going to use the rest of what's in Let it cook. All right, y'all. So, Marshall told me I need to put these beans in there right now. These are the beans that I'm using. Um, so I have to take mine out when I'm using for my chili cheese. Because I can't have beans, of course. So, I really don't need that much either. So, mine have to cook in a separate pot. And we are about to add these beans. As soon as I get this open. to cook it um, on low with the top on there. So. Put the good old top on there. Put it on low until it's ready. I'm gonna cook mine without the without a top. I'm just gonna cook it on low. There we go. And we'll be back. All right, y'all. This is the sausage I'm using. You can only get this from Louisiana. It's not online. Nothing like that, y'all. You literally have to go to Louisiana to get this. They got a phone number right there. You might want if you want to call. Um, it's in Iowa. Louisiana, Robido's Sausage Kitchen. Is it incorporated? Yeah, Iowa, Louisiana, and that's the number and the zip code if y'all need it. Anyway, so this is the sausage. I'm just gonna split this in half. I'm just gonna have two. 
hot dogs because our sausage dogs, I don't think I need more than that. I think that'll be good. And I'm using my keto hot dog buns. Y'all add a little bit of chili powder, okay? I just added some. And add some um, pepper and some cayenne. Just depending on what you like. But definitely add that celery seed. Y'all, oh my God. It tastes so good in here. I didn't think it would make much of a difference, but it does. What's up, y'all? What's up, mother flipping deal? Y'all using my new little uh, tripod with the light on it, so I don't need that huge light up. Y'all forgot my sweater. Hold on. Y'all let me know if y'all like it. I think it's super cute. It's not something that I would normally wear, but I like it. I'm glad I got it. This, it has like fringe at the bottom and it's like, it's a, a cardigan, a colorful cardigan. It's literally going viral on TikTok. I think it's so cute. I just paired it with some jeans. Um, these are my I was about to say great American, um, good American jeans with this off the shoulder top. I don't know if I'm gonna wear this sweater on camera cause I wanna just wear this white shirt. So I won't be hot, you know what I'm saying? Anyway, um, let me see, my sausage is ready. What am I doing? Hold one second. Hold one second girl. Let me get me a plate and get my, I just air fried my sausage. Oh my God. It looks so freaking good. I'm warming my uh, chili. Y'all that chili is bomb. Okay. This is the sausage. Don't they look amazing? Um, I'm warming my chili. Y'all that chili add beef bouillon it like gives it a deeper flavor oh my god it's so good it is too good okay so what i'm gonna do is i'm going to cut this in half put it in my hot dog buns and i like ketchup on my stuff ketchup and mustard so i'm gonna put chili on them and then cheese on the top uh i was thinking about putting some chopped onions I probably need to, huh? Some yellow chopped onions. Let me chop some up. Hold on. All right, y'all. Are y'all ready? So I'm going to ooh, split that in half. These are the buns I'm using. These are oral wheat keto hot dog buns. Push it over there. Uh oh. Y'all love the skin on this sausage. It's so good. So we're just going to sit those in there like that. Then we're going to take whatever kind of cheese you want. This kind I want. Actually, I'm going to put it in there like that. Like that. Set that on top. I'm eating pickles and chips with this. Um, sit her like that. Just like that. Okay. And, okay, I'm gonna put that on after the chili. Hold up, I don't wanna put this chili on until the very last minute, hold on. These are the chips I'm eating, protein chips. All right, y'all, here we go. I should have put some cheese under there too. Some shredded cheese, but it's too late now. <laughs> just like that. And then I'm just gonna squirt some, um, mustard and some ketchup on top. I can't put the ketchup on until I get over there to the table because that's where the ketchup is. So. Mm. 
just like that. Then we're gonna take some of this shredded cheese. You can use whatever cheese you want. Cause what is your hot dog? This is about to be bomb. Okay, just like so. I need to hurry up, girl. One of those late nights again. Um, yellow onion. Yellow onion, girl. Oh, that's gonna be so good. I should have put the mustard under all of this. I should have said, but I didn't. So we just gonna have to deal weedy. I hope this is open already. And then we gonna put ketchup on top of that. Oh, this is about to be good, y'all. plate for the night. All right, let me bring you up a little bit. Boom. Del Usually I have three, y'all. I'm doing good. <laughs> Look at that. Oh. Okay, let's go. Let's go eat. Oh, we made, we have some homemade sausage glizzies, y'all. Look at that. Doesn't that look amazing? They are chili cheese sausage glizzies with some chips and some pickles on the side, baby. Let's ride. We have an orange vanilla flavored water. Yummy, delicious. Who want a yummy bite? 